Struggling with the decision of what to do after college, thinking about law school but not sure if you're up to the challenge? Well, I was in the same position last year, and I wanted to let you in on a little secret about what law school teaches students. Legal writing. Learning how to write a legal memo changed my life. So you see students, predictive memos communicate objective analysis in a clear, deductive framework. Writing memos helps you organize and communicate material effectively and thoroughly to your reader. Your reader is going to have context and justification for your predictions. The format, which goes from general to specific, assists the reader in the comprehension of the material and enables the skeptical, law-trained reader to independently evaluate the basis for the predictions that you make. So, honey, where do you want to go eat tonight? Well, I was thinking about it, and I think seafood sounds good. But, I don't know, I was kind of craving um, tacos. So I think that that would be really good, too. But then there's that new restaurant on the east side of town that has really good Asian food, and I was thinking maybe we should go there. Yeah, uh, I figured uh, that you'd have a problem. You usually can't decide on where to eat, so I went ahead and prepared this. Um, why don't you read that and uh, let me know when you're finished, and I think you'll, you'll really get a good idea of where we're actually going to go tonight. I'll talk to you later. Okay. In light of the undisputed facts that Olive Garden requires less travel time, and further, that Matt and Sarah have additional studying to do at the conclusion of the evening, it is patently clear that the only available option that will meet the demands of all parties is dinner at the Olive Garden. Because that format comports with the expectations of the law-trained reader, because analogies are thorough and explicit, and predictions are well supported, the reader's understanding of and agreement with your position is secure. Also recognize that the predictive framework will translate nicely as the foundation for the persuasive framework that we'll be studying next semester. Alright, so check it out guys. Best position ever. One fantasy football team, three quarterbacks, I can only start one. Who do you go with? Peyton Manning, Kurt Warner, or Philip Rivers? If it was me, I'd go with Philip Rivers. You can't... Philip I mean, Rivers? Why would you go with Philip Rivers? You gotta start Peyton Manning. Peyton Manning's awesome. We, 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 haven't even, we, we haven't even talked about the Golden Boy yet. Kurt Warner. Kurt Warner? Arizona Cardinals. Seriously? Arena Kurt football. Warner? Put He's up like 40 to 50 points a week. That's absolutely you, you can count Guaranteed. You, that. you, you see, gotta start Peyton Manning. Kurt Warner. Peyton Manning. Kurt Warner. Peyton Manning. Where'd you go? Philip Rivers. And here's why. I'd like to direct your attention to argument two on page four, whereby the San Diego ground attack is directly responsible for an increase in the both passing completion percentage and total yardage of the San Diego offense, if offensive passing yardage. So there you go. Hmm. The rivers. Three hours? That's the best you can do? Well, thanks, but no thanks. I mean, this is due in two, so I have to get it figured out. I have to file this in two hours. All right, well, I'll see if I can figure it out myself. Word perfect. Perfect. Come in. Hey, big brother, what's the problem? Oh, hey, little bro. I have this brief that's due in two hours. IT can't help me. It's three hours. I need to figure this out. I'm trying to get, it's, the formatting is all messed up. I, I don't know what to do. Well, what, what are you trying to do? You're trying to load something in, or how are you getting that document in? Yeah, I just copy and paste it from word to word perfect, and this is what it gave me. Yeah, I figured that was probably going to be uh, the issue you were having, so I went ahead and prepared this brief for you. It should outline the problems you're having and tell you how to fix them. So that should be all you need. If it's not, let me know, but I bet that's going to solve it. Thanks, little bro. When copying and pasting from WordPerfect, you must be sure to clear all formatting in the document. Otherwise, you clearly have problems with the formatting in your new document. That was such a great dinner. I know, it was like the perfect night. Honey, will you marry me? I... I don't know what to say. I... I need more time to think. I... 
So you can see that Bill Stevens has mastered the art of predictive reasoning. He excels at this disciplined form of written communication, and this has become the foundation for his persuasive analysis and his life as an advocate. I think you can see that having mastered this skill, all of his wildest dreams have come true.